I think at some point I'll have to go out on the kitchen and get a refill of water. Holy shit. That's due, Dan. So, how the fuck was Zarbon and Doria able to beat both Raccoon and Goldo when Raccoon was destroying Vegeta, Krillin, and Go Gohan combined? Huh. Okay. Well, to be fair, if both those could do that to Raccoon, then there is a very good chance I actually could beat Vegeta. Maybe. Hmm. And I never thinking that Raccoon lost because of a fluke. Yeah. Yeah. Feel free to believe what you want. All right. Let's see what we can do here. Raccoon or. Jason Burger. Boy, those would be interesting. One, two, three. Going for it. I remember these two actually giving me quite a bit of a pro. Oh, hey, it's automatic. Okay. Alright. Yeah, I remember these two have given me problems before, actually. So, this will be something for sure. Oh, okay. So, I, I guess it's just automatically transforming me into a second form uh, Zarbon. Why the hell not? That makes you want, kind of makes me wonder that if Zarbon actually trained, if he will reach additional transformations, then again, how it could possibly get uglier than his this form? Uh, yeah, I don't know. This move is pretty fun. I think so. <laughs> All right. So actually, what does he have? Um. Oh my God! False courage on this character. Jesus. That. Could potentially make Zarbon fairly good because he already has a fucking rolling hammer. Oops. Yeah, he has a rolling hammer in that moveset. <laughs> oh shit, okay. Something like that. This is a really fun ultimate, though. I won't lie. Okay, so what have I get? Okay, I saw a false courage, but high tension. Okay. Oh, huh. Okay. It's not finish sign. I should have never really used a character with high tension before, so this is interesting. <laughs> Whatever it is, it costs f three fucking blast gauges, so you know that's that's fun. Yeah. S rank. Okay, sure. Why not? I mean, I don't really feel like I deserved this rank there, but I'll take it. Why not? <laughs> All the asterisks around fastest being in the universe. Then I guess you're just the second fastest. Speed really has no bearing on your actual combat ability. So, what are you going to do about Captain Ginyu? I feel a lot closer to you all of a sudden. I love it. Yeah, there's a little more meat to this than I remember there being. Hmm. Who's the ugly one with you? So you're a transforming alien like Frieza. What is it with these people actually calling each other aliens? I don't know, maybe I'm the only one who finds that juxtaposition weird. You don't have to kill him, Jesus Christ. You can save yourself with the resources, dude. Hmm. It which is um, still amazing that it did not actually happen, but but the whole, you know, actually being killed by Vegeta thing. Uh I don't know, maybe I'm doing it. You'd think that being a blast having a whole blast in your gut would be pretty convincing, but nope. Anyway, so, um, Ginyu here, I'm not sure if this will be an issue, really, but considering it's just one character against two, and both of these characters have a shit ton of super armor, actually I say that, but it, I think Ginyu does have super armor, that is actually impressive. Hmm. Let's see. Yeah, sure, I'll take it. Did, did um this form of 
Zarbon ever actually use that move in his form? I don't remember. Oh, shit. Okay. Okay. Do, do, do. Oh, there's a blast coming towards me. Ah, fuck. Okay. Ooh. But that ram is fuck timing, though. Hmm. Alright. Uh, I probably shouldn't blow my, uh... Oh, never mind. <laughs> I was like, I probably shouldn't blow my ultimate right now, because I'll save it for the next round, and then turn it... Oh, wait, there's the next round. Oops. Hmm. So that was interesting. <laughs> yeah, Captain Ginyu is somehow defeated by both the Doria and Zarbon. Right. Yeah. You just beat Ginyu. Vegeta should be nowhere. N well, okay, Vegeta might be close to his level right now, but I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that is true. I I'd be scared too of a person who shoved their hand through me. As you can see here. Yes, a very duly noted example of that shit. Okay, sure. Why not? <laughs> I know I'm beating each of these story modes in like probably 15 or so minutes. Anyways, now we got this one. The one I actually did not do before, which is using the Ginyu Force to actually beat Vegeta, Gohan, and Krillin. And then eventually Goku when he shows up, I shit you not. Uh, that was it, right? Yeah, okay, cool. Frankly, I was debating on skipping this one altogether because... Well, there's not really anything that can be offered in terms of the story mode for this one, but okay. Alright. I should have probably gone and got some water, but oops. Vegeta had planned to steal the Dragon Balls from Frieza and achieve immortality. There's a certain point here where I actually just like I actually did cover. Oh yeah, we're skipping the animation again. So right, we we've had an, I've had enough of uh the Ginyu Force coming coming down from orbit. No thank you. I'll pass that one again. Uh okay, so let's see. Birder, Raccoon, Jace, Goldo. Who to use? Uh, normally for this one I stick to Raccoon because he's actually kind of fun. A little bit, maybe, sorta. Um, I could use Birder because his combos are fucking stupid. Um, but I don't have anything put on him. Meanwhile, I don't think I have anything but a Raccoon, but... Uh, I don't know. I feel like if I had done this one before, it'd be more fun to choose Burr, but I actually know shit with the Raccoon. You know what? Let's just choose, choose these two. Fuck it. Th they will be interesting. Plus, you know, can never, you can never really go wrong with having Raccoon as your, uh, as your point character. Not really. Alright, so, uh, well, speaking of which, do I even have anything on him? Well, apparently not. It's set to default. Well, I say as I can just customize them right here. <laughs> okay. Well, yeah, actually, let's, let's do that one. Key up, be the default shit. Um, that one. Very don't watch anything when the ally starts to lose health. Yeah. Or my health in this case, in a like either case, maybe I don't know. Uh, what we got. Yeah, sure, that one too. Doubt I wasn't going to be taken down, but, you know, it's never bad to have it. Let's see. Ah, yes, do have a Kum type. Cool stuff. Yep. Alright, return it. Getting back in this bitch. Um, you can visit this place. Are you serious? I'm not sure if I care enough to do that. <laughs> yeah, no. Alright, so it looked like these two were separated in two different groups. Vegeta, my boy. My boy. Okay, sure. Really, both of us against Vegeta? Okay, sure. E even Raccoon by himself would be able to decimate Vegeta because of his sheer fucking endurance, but alright. So yeah, welcome to the tugboat that is Raccoon.
20,000? It's way above that by now, dude. <laughs> Goku was almost at 20,000 when they fought on Earth. Come on. Oh, cool. Yeah, this is one of the reasons why uh, having Burr on your team is not really a bad thing. Alright, come on. Pfft. Also, Raccoon just has like a really dumb fucking bullshit key blast thing. I love how he's still running around. Why would you run that way, sir? Why would you run? Alright, cool. Come on. <laughs> love how he just barely sidestepped that. But, uh, Burr is ridiculous because of his really fucking fast moveset. I mean, you know, I, I give him shit for, you know, that supposed fastest being in the universe title, but now he does have some weight in this game. Kinda. Ah, uh, you gotta love when you waste your ultimate because the AI decides to t stop taking damage for a cutscene. Oh, shit. <laughs> that took about, like, 12 years to actually fucking come out from the time it was activated. Oh my god. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> nice, no, it's, it's really convenient when an opponent does actually get into a blast or a rush sequence with uh, an opponent because you can just sit there and charge. It's fucking amazing. Wait, is this someone he was talking about? But who are you jerks? Not even posing out of 10. What a disappointment. What? Okay, sure, why not? <laughs> You're on. What? Why would I... Oh... Fuck. I was about to say, why, why did I bother to fight these guys when I originally... Uh, Resolve to just get through the story mode or just as soon as possible. Eh. I don't know. I guess I was just bored or kind of curious, also. Alright, anyway, let's see what we can do. So, I love how these guys are actually voiced by fucking TN. Also, that was a cool charge animation. Holy crap. I love those uh, fucking early, early, early 90s uh, animations. So good. Anyway, so. Let's see what we got here. This move is obnoxious, though. Uh, I think... Mm. Yeah, all the game force was playable in uh, Battle. It's amazing I still remember this much shit about Battle Z, considering I've only... haven't touched that game in fucking years. Like, literally years at this point. Mm-hmm. Pfft. Hmm. Key Blast is just... Keep going right over him. Because what the fuck's accuracy? I have no idea. Uh, I love when people are randomly messaging me on Facebook. Facebook at 1040 at night. Hmm. <laughs> I wonder if that was one of the special battles. Guess so. Why not? So, Krillin. Actually, it's amazing that Krillin and Gohan haven't had any major, major battles up until this point in the Namek Saga. Um, yeah, they just kind of kept running around Dodoria and Vegeta. This is the first time they've actually had a serious fight in this show. Well, not, okay, not in the show, but just in the Namek Saga alone. I, also, I love how the, a lot of Raccoon shit is in an actual combo. Are you seeing this? Like, what does the first string? It's, it works, but then you get the second hit, or the second part of the string, and it just... It just drops. Like, that's amazing. The only reason they're getting hit right now is because they're pressing buttons or not guessing which direction they should block. <laughs> I didn't even notice they, char they posed during the uh, charges as awesome. Are you gonna reappear anytime soon? Alright. Oops, okay. Fuck. Uh, if I just let the... Oh, wow, that hit. Oh, okay. 
I was gonna say that if I didn't fucking continue the string for heavy finish, I totally wouldn't be able to just do it one time and then go my into my ultimate. But nope. Yeah. Okay. No, this is actually kind of making me curious if I should try out Raccoon more in uh, Budokai Three, because he has a really fun uh, move with Raccoon Kick. Oh, at least I think it's kind of cool. And incoming ship. So, are you writing for something ridiculous? Yeah. We're about to have Goku be beaten by the Ginyu Force. If Goku was able to be taken out by not even Captain Ginyu, but just like regular Raccoon, there's something wrong here. This is a thing. Yeah. <laughs> they turn one at a time, it's great. Uh huh. Sadly, this game is about to make it look like he actually does have a power level of 5,000. Seriously though, Vegeta only had a power level of fucking 20,000. I know it's way above that. I know for a fact that it's definitely like at least three times that. At the very least. Eh. Anyway, so let's see what we can do. Oh, I see. Oh, okay, the combo does maintain if you um if you go to normal, I like neutral. Oh, okay. Uh-huh. <laughs> Armor, dude. You, you don't want to press the button. For a second there, I thought he was going to touch the ground before that connected. You say that, but, uh, yeah, no. Oh, shit. Oh, wow, I didn't know you could take those extensions that far. Come on, do it. Yeah, he's not avoiding this one. Yeah, f holy crap, we already killed one of his stocks? Damn. That was not too terrible. Mm. Pretty good, I must say. Sweet. Alright. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Goldo's the one saying low-class monkey. You gotta be kidding me. All for a chocolate parfait. An elite group of mercenaries called from all over cold? Their strength is immeasurable. Uh, that's the word now, cold. Okay. Under Freeze's orders, they are a force to be reckoned with. They have one goal. Total well, apparently normally they're an actual mercenary gang, but they were just hired on by Freeza for this shit. Sure. Alright, so, uh, yeah, I guess I did win that. Cool. Now, if I were to go ahead and do it again, I could probably do it with Goldo and Jace, which, you know, I don't care that much. Uh, complete request. I thought I did already. Yeah, whatever. So, uh, almost done with the, with the Namek Saga, I guess. Yeah, cool. Um, let's see. Yeah, so, we, we are officially done with the fucking, uh, what was it? We are officially done with the Ginyu Force, though. Don't worry about that, because that was getting a little irksome, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, so I'm now a square hour into this. I've gotten four of the 11 ones out of the way. Pretty good. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna take a really small break, and I'm just gonna get myself a refill on water, because I'm parched. Mm, damn. Okay, back in a sec, folks.